Hey guys, what's going on? Steven and Alex at Crux. We're gonna go through a quick exercise. It's a variation of the hip airplane. We call it wall reach. Um, really great. We're, we're using it with a lot of patients who need uh, posterior chain lengthening as well as strengthening as well as patients who need to floss through that sciatic nerve. Um, it's also fantastic for building up stability in that frontal plane. So here we go. What we're gonna do is Alex is gonna stand at an appropriate length away from the wall. This is different for everyone. So um, what I recommend is, you know, start a couple feet away from the wall. You know, Alex would kind of like start here, go through one rep, realize he's too close, and then scoot back um, to make it harder as we go on. So go ahead and come on back up. All right, so that's what the eventual position is going to look like. Uh, what we're going to do is Alex is going to balance on one foot. He's going to kick. He's going to have a soft knee on the stance leg, meaning we're not completely locked out, but we're also not bent here. We're just soften that knee by bending a slight amount. Now he's going to take his hands and reach towards the wall. This is why we call this one the wall reach. As he's reaching out, he's really trying to extend out. We're keeping the hips nice and level. This back heel is pushing back as far as he can towards that wall. This is the position that we're starting from. Some people, if we do this in the clinic with you, this might be as far as we go. Then we return back up to standing. Okay, go ahead, reach on out. Again, we're flossing the nerve on the leg that is stance leg down. Good, and then come on back. One more time on this basic position here, Alex, reaching all the way out. He's extending his arms, reaching as far as he can, and reaching this leg back as far as he can. Notice how his back remains nice and straight. That's part, one of the nice things this exercise does is teach that hinging pattern, keeping a neutral spine. Now, the hip airplane aspect of this <clears throat> involves some rotation. So, Alex, go ahead, go into that position. He's gonna reach all the way out. Now, this is just the starting position for step two. Now, he's gonna take the lifted leg side with this hand, he's going to raise this arm up using the wall as a balance. He's gonna use that. At the same time, he's squeezing the muscles in the back of his hip here on this stance leg side. Then come on back down, Alex. Good, let's just go straight on back up again from that position. Now, notice that his hip and his shoulder are moving at the same time. He is like a plank of wood from the shoulders down through the pelvis. Go ahead, back down there, Alex. Good, I hope you're fatiguing just a little bit. Now, hold that position. Now, I'm gonna have you dip down just a little bit. So he's going to bring that stance leg stays in that position, that swinging leg, the hip drops down towards the floor. So go ahead, drop down, and then right back up. He can hold the wall for that position. Alex, last time, come all the way up and go through that full rotation and then all the way back down to the other side. That looks really, really good. Good control, keeping the, a nice soft knee on the way down, keeping the torso completely level. Perfect, cool. So this is the wall reach variation of the hip airplane. We love this new exercise and we think you will too. Thanks for watching.